Hello, it's me, Kent Peterson again. And this bill, you see the towel. But our idea of a rich is all wrong, man. So when you think of a rich person, when you think of yourself being rich or there being a rich person, what do you think? You probably picture that person having expensive clothes, wearing $500 clothes. I never spent $500 in my life on clothes and never will either. You picture them driving an expensive car like a Tesla, Ferrari, Lamborghini. You just picture it. Them drive those kind of cars. A home, you picture them having a big old mansion. You picture them going to fancy restaurants, spending $100, $200 even on a meal. So we all got our idea of what a rich person is. But here's the thing. Things aren't always what they seem. So there could be a there could be two people. One of these people, they kind of like a nice fancy car. They could even have nice clothes on. Maybe a nice haircut. But then there could be another person. He could be driving a car that looked like it's beat down. Maybe. His shirt is only like five dollars. His pants are only five dollars. And his hair is wild. It looked like he had to cut his hair in maybe over a year. So y'all probably got this idea in your head that the person that's driving the nice fifty thousand dollar car, five hundred dollar suit, and maybe spent a hundred dollars on his haircut. You probably picture that guy being rich and the other guy, you picture him being poor. Well, here's the thing. The guy that's driving the beat up car, drive, who's wearing the cheap clothes, who haven't cut his hair, guess what? That guy could easily be the billionaire. And the guy, you see yourself, the guy you see as being rich, he could actually be poor. That car he has, those nice clothes he has, guess what? He used something, it's called credit cards. So he's not rich. He's just trying to look rich. Which I call fake rich. I mean, there's this book called the, uh, what is it called? The Millionaire Next Door, I believe it is. I think I have it on my Kindle somewhere. So basically, some people, they don't live like they're rich. They pretty much live like they're middle class or even poor in some cases. But they're rich. Then there's these poor people. That's like fake rich. They pretend they have all this money. I mean, a car will be more expensive than a home. They're pretty much wasting hundreds of dollars on clothes. Let's be honest. There's clothes that I, that I spent less than $20 on that actually last for years or even decades. So I'm going to tell you the truth. So the so spending $500 on clothes is pretty much a waste of money to me. Because in the end, they're going to get old. Same thing with a car. Spending $50,000 on a car is a waste of money because cars depreciate. They're not like houses. There's rich people out there. 
that don't even live in a mansion. They live like in a normal house and some may even live in a small house. They live normal lives. Some of them might even have normal jobs. They just don't want attention. That's why. So the real rich people, not all, I know there's some rich people out there that like to flash money around, but it's mostly the fake rich people. Some of these fake rich people, they buy like these juries, these watches. That they look like they're gold watches, but they'll be fake gold. So you can't always rely on people wearing all this gold. Because that gold could be fake. Some people drive this kind of car. Let me show you. Unfortunately, there's people like in front of my car show. I didn't want to like film them while I'm doing a video. I was going to show you what some rich people drive. But like I said in the last video, I drive cars. It's actually 2015. How long is that? 16 years? I bought the car in 2008, so it was kind of, it was kind of new. I think it had like 26, 27,000 miles on it when I bought it. And the car kept up pretty good. I had for like 13 years. I mean, it still drives good. The outside of it, it's... It's a little beat down, kind of. I'm thinking about maybe fixing it up. And possibly maybe sell it. <laughs> or keep it longer. Who knows? Like they say, if it's not broke, don't fix it. <laughs> and my car's not really broke right now. It still gets me to where I want to go. I mean, it's not a fancy car, but it gets me to where I need to be. I mean, if I was rich, would I spend a lot of money on jewelry? Probably not. I mean, I'm I'm happy just wearing watches like this. I mean, would I wear a gold watch? I mean, it's possible I, I may wear a gold watch, but it won't be anything too crazy like you think it would be. Because one thing I realize about people, people love to impress other people. They like look good in front of other people. So they'll pretend to be rich. Some of these cars, these brand new cars, guess what? They can easily rent, them. I can easily rent like a, any car made in like 2021. I can, I can rent a car at Enterprise. Get me some really expensive clothes on a credit card. Then I go on a date with a girl. Just I can literally look good for that date. I can lie about how I'm rich, how I'm making money. And it probably would draw her in, but guess what? I'm only hurting myself because I'm making a false image of myself. Because in the long run, once that girl finds out that I'm not really rich, that I've been lying, guess what? She's most likely going to run away. So you should never be fake rich. So that's one thing I learned in a millionaire next door. Like some of these rich people, many of them actually. They just live normal lives. I mean, how do I know this person that store's not a millionaire? I mean, sure, I live in apartments, so do these other people, but how do I know they're not millionaires? I don't. <laughs> I just assume they're not millionaires. How do y'all know I'm not a millionaire? Y'all don't, but I'm gonna tell you I'm not a millionaire. Who knows, maybe one day I will be one. That is one of my goals, is to be a millionaire. 
So I just wanted to go over this idea of rich and how many of us have it wrong. Because we just picture a rich person having like really nice clothes, an expensive car, maybe even an expensive house. But sometimes poor people have expensive homes. They just can't afford to pay it off. So this is just a quick video. If you like this video, give me a thumb up, subscribe to my channel. I'm so sorry I wasn't able to show my car. There was somebody like in front of my car and I didn't really want to bother them. But if you want to see other videos in the future, if you want to be notified every time I make a video, just hit on that bell button. And with that being said, have a good day. Bye for now.